Hey everybody, it's been a little while since I posted a video. Let's do some card readings. How fun is that? It's a rainy evening here in Florida and I'm sitting here with the dog and you know what? I was watch, doing some work and I thought I went to my YouTube and I'm like, let me draw some cards. So here we go with Super Attractor. Okay. Uh, this is Gabby Bernstein Stack, one of my favorite mentors and spiritual coaches. Dear God, show us what card we need to see. Dear God and universe, I can do less and attract more. Ooh, one of my favorites. One of my favorites. Ooh, that's good. All right, one more from this deck. <sighs> to begin the practice of allowing, I must get out of the way and let spirit give me direction. To begin practice to, to begin the practice of allowing, I must get out of the way. A lot of times we're in our own way, the ego usually. And let spirit give me direction. Let God and the universe give us direction. Ooh, I love that. When we get quiet, we get direction too. When we sit still and we turn off all the distractions. Okay. Let's do the other Gabby deck. The universe has your back. All right. Dear God, universe, show us what card we should read. I am the dreamer of my dream. I am a dream builder coach now with the Brave Thinking Institute. And I have um, week, uh, monthly vision workshops. I also have a pre-recorded vision workshop. It's 30 minutes and it's so powerful. And I hope you will um, be interested to watch that or sign up for the free live vision workshop. And you will learn three key ingredients to manifesting a life that you love. Okay, here we go. Whoops. Through prayer and meditation, I create a ripple effect of peace in the world. Gorgeous gorgeous okay do one more i let go of the shadow of the past by seeing someone for the first time with the eyes of love that's beautiful we shouldn't hold grudges and everybody changes all the time and we can't yeah we don't want anyone judging us from something we said or did in the past okay i am gonna draw now from How to Love Yourself, Louise Hay. Super good duck. Because self-love is the basis of everything. If you want positivity and success in all areas of your life, the basis is for you to love, honor, and treat yourself well. And I've been on that path for so long. And uh, yeah, it's important. Okay. I use my words and thoughts as tools to shape my future. Mm. Life is very simple. I create my experiences by my thinking and feeling patterns. What I believe about myself and about life becomes true for me. Okay, guys, one more card. Every habit and pattern I create serves me in some way. When I am ready to let it go, the universe helps me release it. I have the power to make change. I have, I support myself in making the right choices for me. These have messages on both sides. I am incredibly capable whenever I encounter a challenge in my life. I use the experience to learn and grow love and the last message is i am good enough i am good enough i am good enough yes you are and i am going to draw for money and the law of attraction because i think a lot of people are challenged challenging 
you know, having challenges financially. So here's the first card that op I opened up to. Lucky, you have to go out? Okay. When you find yourself critical of the way anyone has attracted or is using money, you are pushing money away from you. But when you realize that what others do with money has nothing to do with you and that your primary work is to think and speak and do what feels good to you, then you will be in alignment for not only about the sub not only about the subject of money, but about every important subject in your physical experience. This is super powerful. I will praise success wherever I see it. Okay, this is so powerful because if we're judging somebody else, okay, that's a block. If you're judging how someone else is obtaining money or attracting money or charging or anything, that is a block. I realize that. Yes, and I've been guilty of it. Okay, last card. And then Lucky wants to go out. This is from Miracles Now. This is a Gabby deck that is not made anymore. She doesn't make this deck. I welcome abundance and I will pay attention to the guidance I receive. Mm, I love that, right? And I also welcome prosperity. Because abundance is all around. We have such an abundant universe. Okay. My happiness can be measured by the level of faith of my faith and love. Oh. All right. Lastly is to truly flourish is to release all the tension that holds me back from letting love pour through me. So good. My positive energy leaves a powerful impression on the world. I hope that I do leave a powerful impression on the world. If you haven't checked out Empowered the Podcast, there's some great episodes. Check it out. Have a beautiful evening, everyone. Thank you for watching. Until next time, live empowered, love yourself, and check out my Dream Builder Vision Workshops. Um, take care, everybody.